What's going on guys, Josh Pocock here, and we've covered many different open source AI tools from Together AI. And in today's video, they actually just recently created a new one called Logo Creator, a free open source logo generator that creates professional logos in seconds using Flux Pro 1.1. I'm going to show you how you can easily get this set up in the next few minutes and start generating custom logos ASAP. Let's dive right into it. All right, guys, so all links we go over in this video will be linked down below and we'll get right into actually setting this up just to quickly go over the tech stack here. We got Flux Pro 1.1. This will be used on Together AI. For logo generation it's a next.js app chat cn ui tailwind for styling upstash redis for rate limiting this is optional when you're setting it up clerk for authentication plausible and helicone for analytics and observability so there's really two ways you can actually use this app one is you can self-host it which i'm going to show you in just a second the other way is you can actually just go to logocreator.io or logo-trader.io. I'll leave a link down below. And all you have to do is just add your own Together API key. They do give you three free generations without your API key, but you're gonna have to add your API key if you're gonna wanna generate more. And then you have to sign in as well, create an account, and then you can simply do, like add your company name right here, like Executive Stride, for example. You can select the style, so we can do tech, flashy, modern, minimal, abstract, playful, and then we can do our primary color. So blue, red, green, yellow, and then our background color. So white, gray, black, you could add additional info here as well. Like, you know, make it look professional or whatever the case may be. And then you click on generate logo. Okay. And boom, we got a logo right here, executive stride.com. Of course you can go play around with it, change the styling, change the additional info, the colors, etc. So sometimes you can regen, like you can go over here, regenerate, you can download, um, you could change the color. Sometimes the color I find isn't always perfect when using it. All right, so here's another one. We got executive stride as well. So this is tech. Of course, you can try different ones. We'll try some more examples in just a second. Now you will see that there is four options here for primary and three for background. Now, I personally just actually forked the repo and made a few little changes and you could actually make some more changes to yourself. I'll show you that in just a second if you want. I'll also leave a link to my forked version as well. Um, I didn't do too many changes, just a couple, and I'll show you that in just a second. Now, before we get this set up, you're going to want to, at the bare minimum, have a clerk account. All right, and once you have a clerk account, you can actually go to your project right here. When you have a project, you're gonna to wanna to create one and then click on API keys, and that's gonna give you the uh, API keys that we're gonna wanna put in our environment variables in just a second, so keep that in handy. And you're also gonna want a Together AI account. So you can go to together.ai, um, I'll leave a link down below. You can sign up for a free account, and you're going to, um, they give you some API credits, a decent amount to start out, so you, or at least when I signed up, they did. I don't know exactly if, you know, how much they're giving out right now. Could have changed. Um, you're going to want to add your credit card or your card to the account. At least I had to. It was giving me an error saying that you at least need to have your card added to your account. But I, I added my card to my account um, and then it was working for the generations. I still actually haven't been charged anything other than my free API credits as of now. Okay, once you do that, you're going to want to git clone the repo. So you can copy this uh, command right here, git clone, and then the URL right here. If you're using the forked version that I made, you can use that as well. Either way works. All right, so you would run git clone URL link right here, and then you would change directory. So you would go CD logo creator, uh, this one right here. And once you CD into the repo location, I ran code dot, but yeah, you can open this in your, the editor of your choice, whether that's cursor, um, VS code, windsurf, whatever the case may be, you're gonna wanna open it in your IDE. And the main thing you're gonna wanna do is go to your .env.example and create a copy of this and then rename it to .env. As you can see here, these are the environment variables it's asking for, upstash. You don't need upstash. Um, this is for rate limiting. I didn't add it. You could add it if you wanted to. Together a API key, I added this. You're gonna need that for sure. And then the clerk, you do need these two. So this will show uh, you'll get that from the environment or from the uh, API section that I showed you uh, earlier. 
And then Helicone, you don't need this. Um, this is optional. So you really just need Cleric and Together AI right there. And once you do that, you can actually just uh, run npm install and then npm run dev. Now, the one thing that I did change in the uh, forked version was um, you probably noticed that there was only four different colors available, you know, with the drop down menu, which I personally wanted a bit more. So I simply just went into windsurf. And if you want to make changes as well, you could just go to cursor, windsurf, whatever the case may be. And I basically just said, hey, um, can we add multiple colors and just kind of show you where that change is if we go to our under api under our app and then generate logo and then you'll see the route.ts right here um, you can kind of see this is exactly the api um, that we're sending out to together ai we can see the different styles we have here so the flashy style textile modern style and then the prompt associated with that that is being sent so if you wanted to make changes to the actual prompts the underlying prompts you could do so i mean you could actually customize this uh app pretty um you know quite a bit if you want to you know leverage flux for different things you know maybe even besides just logos um you can see the prompt right here uh, a single logo blah blah blah, blah professional for mentioning the uh, selected style right here as well as the primary color and background color right here and the company name and then the additional info right here so all that's being mentioned in the prompt we can see um this right here the st the size width you see the model we're using right here flux 1.1 pro now under page here you'll see i added um different colors so opposed from just those four colors we got red blue yellow green orange purple black white and gray here so that gives us a bit more options so if i go to the self-hosted version right here of the fourth version i have you can see we got a drop down here with all the different primary ones now i did do initially i tried doing a color picker here where you could just like select any color and it would you know have the hex code but i wasn't getting um in the generations maybe you know if one maybe one of you could make that work but for some reason it wasn't really working with the colors so i just decided to send the names the hex colors was getting a bunch of issues when you do like different hex codes so and you know i found that using a drop down menu just with the um with more but having you know sending the names in the prompts like red blue yellow etc works the best as you can see here we got yellow purple um background josh hvac play playful okay we could go ahead add ai coding agent as a name tech right here orange primary background black i'll add some information on additional info right here let's go ahead and click generate okay i got something here it's not the greatest i'm going to generate again okay i changed a few things around i said use company name and logo right here uh, ai coder as you can see and um, we got it right here so i think this is kind of cool you can play around with it um like i showed you too if you're using something like windsurf or cursor you could easily kind of change around some of the prompts and whatnot and um, even you know some things around the app and use it to um, leverage flux 1.1 and the power behind it to do image generations and you could even change this around so like i said it's not just a logo it's like an image generator maybe or whatever the case may be even if you do uh, want to use it just for logos um, you know whether you're starting a new company or a new project or whatever the case may be you can get some really good ideas the concepts or if you just need to generate some quick logos on the fly, I think this could be a useful app. But let me know what your thoughts are in the comments down below, guys. I just wanted to share this quick one with you. If you have any issues setting it up, let me know and I can try to help you as best as possible. Like I said, all links will be covered in the description down below. I think it, uh, Flux is really, really powerful. If you haven't used it already, this is an easy way to get started and try it out. But other than that, guys, that's pretty much it for today's video. If you're new to the channel, we upload videos all the time on AI, marketing, sales, business growth. So if you like the type of content, you got some value here, then like the video, comment down below, and subscribe to stay up to date with the uploads. Also, too, guys, if you haven't already joined our free community, stratacommunity.com, I'll leave a link down below to our free Facebook group and Discord channel. And then also, too, guys, if you run a business and you need help with marketing, sales, operations, implementing AI, AI agents, AI call center into your business, then book a call down below at executivestride.com forward slash apply. Other than that, guys, I will see you in the next video. 
keep hustling, keep grinding, and of course, guys, accelerate your stride. Take care. Are you tired of pouring thousands of dollars into appointment setters only to watch leads slip away? Imagine having a team of elite sales agents booking qualified appointments for you around the clock. No more wasted time on training, no more frustration with performance, and no more draining your budget on inconsistent and expensive call centers. Introducing Stride Agents. AI-powered appointment setters that work 24 seven, never get tired and book appointments while you sleep. Trained on thousands of successful conversations, our AI agents outperform human teams at just one-tenth of the cost. Join the ranks of businesses that doubled their appointments and booking rates in just a matter of weeks. Don't get left behind in the AI revolution. Visit strideagents.com now and transform your entire sales process with cutting-edge AI technology. It's time to accelerate your stride with AI agents.